Yes. Uh, still ahead on the couch, we're mixing up Valentine's Day cocktails that'll have you cheering for love. Well, you know what's really sexy on Valentine's Day? What? What? <laughs> Anything after you've had a great <laughs> cocktail or two. Yeah, that's true. Seriously, <laughs> a great way to cap a romantic dinner tonight is to make your honey an awesome drink. Mm -hmm. Master mixologist Nicole Traska is Hi. here with some fantastic nice recipes. <laughs> happy Valentine's Day. Thank you. Day. Happy Valentine's Day, guys. So, good and plenty. Yes. Not just for uh, candy anymore. Not for right? kids anymore. Yeah, yeah. It's all sexed up now. <laughs> no, awesome. Um, Let's Lu get to Lucid it. Lucid is now um, available in the States. It was on a big prohibition for years and years. Well, what, is, what is Lucid? Lucid is um, an absinthe. Okay. So it, it was not allowed. They said that Van Gogh cut off his ear and all this crazy stuff went nuts and, you know, all that. So now we have it back and it's good for us to drink. So I made it today with Camus, uh, Camus Maison coffee, Camus itself, and the Lucid. It's ready to go. This makes it so easy if you do have someone over, you want to get a little pep in your step, you know, get it, get the party going. And it's I just the two, it's just the two things? Uh, three ingredients, okay. Camus, Lucid, That's and coffee. Easy. Yeah, okay. super easy. Now, I'm Keep about to taste this. Does this taste like the candy, the good and plenty it candy? It should. Survey very, says. It's very sweet, but you do get, you, you get that coffee yeah. sense too. Mm -hmm. So it brightens, you, it brightens the senses and then brings you back to like childhood. How strong you know? does the coffee have to be? Uh, a little bit stronger than normal, just you like that. Definitely taste it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. A little Very bit stronger nice. than That's normal. That's great. Easy to make during the party, too. Yep. What's next? Uh, this is the Red Hot Lovin'. It's made with Fonseca. Fonseca is a, a port. It's a ruby port. It's delicious. And then I have a little. Um, a little hibiscus flower in here that's edible, and it's a nice little treat at the bottom. So that's, um, you're pouring on flour? Yep. And has that okay. been, like, marinated in something? Uh, yes, and it's a, it's in its own juice. Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. And then we're going to mix it with some Laurent Perrier Rosé. Mm -hmm. This is really nice and effervescent. This has, like, cassis notes whoa, whoa, in it. Whoa, 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 there we go. Perfect Oh, oh uh, you're good. We almost, had to, <laughs> we almost had to lick the top off that one. <laughs> and... You know how... Now that's all you do. You don't. There's no shaking. There's no nothing. Nope. It's just ready to go. Now, wh how did you come up with this name? Red hot lovin'. Red hot lovin'. Uh, because the the hibiscus flower to me looks like a you know flame, so it's like eternal like burning flame. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me, I heard somebody need a hey, little hey, champagne. Hey, cheers! <laughs> and I wanted to go. save the day. No, I, I think that we need champagne for one of these drinks, right? Yeah, here you go. Yeah, here we go. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Cheers, everybody! I made it just in time, <laughs> oh. right after the fit minute. Boy, that yeah, you worked great. yourself it's out. Good, right? yeah. Cheers. So, so these little sugar daddy pops. Yes, this I made these actually. You if you can't find sugar good. daddy pops, you can take just caramel candy and, and squish it down and make it on a little skewer. It's really easy. They look perfect. It's mm. it's fun to make, you know. Okay, so what's this in is, the drink? Uh, this is uh, cream soda and a little bit of butterscotch schnapps. Oh By boy. the way, called the sugar daddy drink. It is right. called the sugar daddy. I like a sugar daddy. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah. And then this is made with Camus cognac, which oh, is my gosh. beautiful. Oh, how do you pronounce that? Camus. Camus. Okay, is that like really popular now? Um, it, it's popular in my house. <laughs> oh, yeah, all that matters. Or at a lot of bars, like they're doing a lot yeah. of variation on it. So it's for you, sugar daddy. This is great. <laughs> Get, it. Get it, sugar daddy. Get in there. Now, will this? How long? How long can I make this drink last? A uh, long time with the candy. Yeah, yeah I guess sugar, sugar daddy. daddy. <laughs> um, yes, no pun intended, right? Okay, now what about for the non-alcoholic drinkers or the designated drivers of the night? So usually the people that don't drink, you know, taking it easy. So this is the Rosy Palmer, um, and it is made with strawberries and fresh lemonade and unsweetened iced tea. Oh, it's That's like right. an Arnold Palmer. Yeah. Yeah. Rosie, Rosie, Palmer. Palmer. Rosie is Arnold's sister. Rosie is his little sister. Yeah. Yes. And then you yeah. can take she a little a uh, <laughs> heart-shaped <laughs> strawberry and make it a little Valentine's. Oh, oh, that's, that's adorable. adorable. That's cute. That is cute. Let me take this out for you. All right, I'm drinking. What's next? <laughs> and then moving on, I j we just have a uh, Laurent Perrier Rosé. This, uh, this is uh, the color it gets is from uh, Pinot Noir, mm -hmm. and uh, I garnished it with a little filthy cherry. What's a filthy cherry? A filthy cherry is uh, That's good. a brandied cherry. Go, kids. Oh, these are the ones that you that you like. Soak them in yes. alcohol. Mm -hmm. These are Cheers. fun so cherries, So it gives you a little kids. extra. <laughs> Happy <laughs> Valentine's Day, guys. Happy Thank you for Valentine's having me back. Day. These yes, are so much and fun. And congratulations. Hey, congratulations. 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 Thank you. Congratulations. What happened? Oh, you got married? No, I'm engaged. I'm getting married in October. Oh, my gosh. Nicole, congratulations. Hi, I love you. That is so cute. You know Scott's having a good time. That's what happens. His bar looks like this. Wait, look at John. John's having a very festive Valentine's Day. By the way, my favorite has got to be this one. You are the sugar daddy. The sugar daddy It was made with you and inspired. 
because it's so. sweet, but it's not overpoweringly <laughs> mm -hmm. sweet. It's just nice and sweet. Yeah. And I love that you say you if you can't find sugar daddies, the traditional ones, just make them just at make home. Make a caramel. Yeah, I was like the nice. creep running around town looking for sugar daddies yesterday, <laughs> and I said, "Excuse me, do you have sugar daddies here?" And they thought I was playing a game. <laughs> you live in New York City, Nicole. I got to make sugar. Like, <laughs> you can get anything in New York other than sugar yes, daddies. And Nicole, you, you can get these you recipes so on our website too, on wlnytv.com slash the couch. Mm. Thank you for joining us. Cheers, Cheers to everybody. Cheers to a happy Valentine's Thank Day. Thank you. Single Valentine's or not. Yes. Yes. yes, that's right.